What is good? Welcome back to the show. It's Beaker's Lab. The gang is back. You guys know what it is. And I hope you're doing good, man. We're doing pretty good. Just got back in the lab here. And we're back for Town Hall 14. Okay, so Max. So you guys know we've been talking about this a lot lately. As soon as I got to Town Hall 14, we started just focusing on maxing this base. And we're doing pretty good. It's been really fun. But there's one thing that we haven't checked out much at all. It, it's Clan War, especially Clan War League. Guys, we're in Clan War League right now. And I think you're all going to agree about this. There's nothing quite like when you log into Clan War League and you look at the, the roster and you see how your clan is doing and you see that your number one player got three starred. Like, it doesn't matter if you got three starred or the lowest person got three starred. When that number one person gets three starred, it's kind of like, you know, what Like what chance do I have? Like, what, do I just do I just leave now? Do I just quit? Do I just forfeit? But guys, get your shades on. Get your shoes off. Even if your number one player gets three starred, you're still going to watch it. Man, I don't think I've seen a max town of 14 get three starred yet. Are you, are you guys with me? All right, this is going to be good. Okay, so by the way... This makes no sense. Wait, wait, wait. Why is Maisie not the... I thought Maisie was our top player. Now it's Tommy in the first... This is so weird. So look, Tommy's the first person. And then the next day, Maisie is number one? What? Either way, they both got the restart. All right. Great job, guys. Aren't you so glad you maxed your bases? And by the way, isn't this such a crazy round? First of all, Indian girls, what's good? So whether or not this is actually an all-girl clan, I mean, you never know, it's, it's online, but I love that, dude. The, we, we need more we need more women in mobile gaming, for sure. I mean, there, there definitely is, but we gotta, we gotta encourage that. So I love it, dude, no matter what. And this was such a good clan. Like, look at that. Look at how good this went. Like, look at our side. Disregard the other side. We had a few fumbles, but for the most part, it was pretty good. But look at all the three stars they got on us. This was a, this was crazy. All right, man, let's see what happened to Maisie first. Oh, I think I started to watch this one. So I only went into this raid because I wanted to see what the max town hall looked like. Man, this raid is going to make me miss the blimp. You guys remember we used to use this all the time? It's so fun. It's so trolly. It's pretty tough to use, especially in this way. Look at this. Let me zoom in. Are you kidding? I mean, it was just the placement was perfect. Everything went great. They are using basically all their spells. And that's why I could never, I could never get into this army because I just love having a, a, just a ton of rage spells. And you don't have room for rage spells in this. You don't have room for anything else except for a ton of, you know, mostly invisibility spells right there in the beginning. Look at what's done already. This is crazy, man. Man, this is going so good. Like, look at this. Shout out to this clan. If they, you know, I don't expect everybody to, like, get a hold of me. I mean, the only place you could get a hold of me, I guess, is come to my clan. So feel free to do that. But uh, this was this was just one of the more fun rounds. And I remember we were talking in the clan chat about it. It was just like, this was a great clan. And we were, we won by one star because it was such a tough matchup. Anyway, Melly, you good? You need anything? I guess he's got some, you got some water? Yeah, he's got some water. Good. It's hot here, man. I don't want to. I want to make sure. All right, guys. So over here, this is another thing. That's why this this raid was so just like above my head because I never was good with balloons. Just never was. I, I think you can choose a path in Clash. You can either go the Hog Rider route. I mean, I guess you should even go beyond that. You should say, I'm a ground attacker or I'm an air attacker. I was never really an air attacker. So I never, you know, I, I just never focused on this. But it looks so professional when you do it right. Look at this. You know, the best part is though, look at the, like, it's a mini queen walk because you have the hero pet and the fact that it was, you know, largely an air raid, she's actually healing. Is that a max hero pet? It's level two, it's level two, I'm done, I'm done. Man, I, I talked to Maisie about this. He was like, yeah, it was it was a fun attack to watch, like go ahead and show it. But guys, our clan has also had amazing three stars. Dude, I love the builder huts. I'm, I'm a little freaked out about the basement down there. I don't really want to know what's down there unless they make, you know what they could have done instead of the builder base, they could have done an underground, which I guess they could still do. I would love to see that. What's down there? Is that where gems come from? I would assume so. When you start the game, none of us are going to remember this. I, I only remember this because 
I, I think I took some pictures. When you start the game, they say some nonsense about like ley lines in the beginning, which is, you know, where, where Elixir comes from, where the power of, of the Clash World comes from. And they could do more with that. I mean, ley lines are just some like generic magical stuff. So it's not like they made up something unique there, but dude, what's underground? Clash, your move. Anyway, it was so fun. This this was a great war round. If anybody from that clan wants to come over and say what's up, feel free. Anyway, guys, we've had a lot of crazy three stars ourselves. Not me. I'm not even in war right now. I got, I'm just, my head is just done. You guys know it's been a crazy couple of weeks, but my clan, they're always on. Okay, so does Maisie have some rule where he either gets three starred or he gets a three star? Because that's what it seems like. You're a beast, Maisie. You got to calm down. Look at that. <laughs>All right, guys, so for this next round, I really wanted to look at this because a bunch of my clanmates were telling me like, yo, Ballad just did a mass hog rider raid. That's what it is, dude. I haven't seen it yet. I'm excited to look at it with you guys. This is not, you know, the number one against the number one, but it doesn't really make that much of a difference at this level. Everybody is so high level. Nobody is even Town Hall 13 anymore. Everybody's Town Hall 14. It's gonna be sick. What's he going for? The eagle? The little bird? Yeah, dude, this is gonna be dope. Let's check it out. Man, I get so incredibly trolled lately by the super minions. I gotta catch up with this. I gotta either bring two poisons or I gotta be more ready for it. What's he gonna do with the super minions? They're so annoying. You know, they are sort of wearing themselves out. They're like using up all their super shots. You know how they get the, what is it? Five long range, extra damage shots in the beginning. Oh, you're such a troll, dude. Stop it. Oh my goodness. That's so fun. I love that. Um, so, okay, they're coming over here. And we've got just the hero gang. They're going to take out the town hall. That's perfect, dude. This is going to be great for a hog raid. I think this kind of a raid, uh, this kind of a base, I mean, it gets kind of intimidating because if you mess up on the town hall, you're going to feel so bad. And you can mess up because these town halls, it's just a trap. It's a massive trap. So you can you can end up using way too many troops or your heroes will die accidentally. And we've all done it. But if you get it, now look. I mean, you just got the base. It's open. There's no town hall. There's no eagle artillery. And you're just going to spam some hogs. Let's check this out. Am I seeing a skeleton spell in there? I wish I saw what happened there. I, I didn't even see what happened. Did he distract a hero with that? Must have distracted something. Either that or an inferno tower. Either way, just so awesome, dude. I always forget to even try doing that. So perfect. Look at that heal spell. I mean, I would have panicked already. Look, you guys watch my videos every day. You know I would have. Ooh, that was rough. Perfect freeze. Man, I would have panicked and, you know, I get to this point in the raid and I don't have any spells left and I need just one more spell. He's got that one more spell. Awesome, dude. Awesome. Anyway, this is going to be kind of a fun part because we're going to go over there to the to the builders. They're doing good. They're, they're getting stuff back up to full health. Oh, look at the Pekka dog. Uh, we could see him for a second there. Did he survive? <laughs> he was the only one. He was like the sacrifice. He's a hero. He gets to come back anyway. He's cool. Anyway, guys, just incredible. I am so glad that my clan recommended this because, I mean, I wonder if Ballad did this in other rounds. Hang on real quick. I want to watch an instant noob replay of this because this part was so good. Look at the minions. Look at the super minions. Oh, did you see that little archer just got bombed? Man, there's so much going on in a raid. You can never see it all. You, you literally have to watch it twice. Awesome, man. All right, guys. So since we saw Maisie get three-starred, we saw an amazing Hoggo Gang three-star, and now we see Maisie three-starred once again, a number one player. So. As we said earlier, Maisie either gets, either gets three starred or he is three starring. You guys want to check it out? This is like <laughs> this is like Maisie's revenge. Let's go. Stop it right now. What is this army? I I I cannot believe. Wait a minute. What is this? Such a troll, dude. It's such a troll. Was there a spawn? Was there like a drop zone right there? There must have been because I, I didn't see where he dropped troops, but. Oh, he's got, he's got sneaky goblins. I didn't even see that because they're so sneaky. I'm sorry. 
That was a terrible joke. Anyway, guys, uh, so that poison is from the town hall, right? Or did he drop something? He dropped a visibility or something? I don't know. It's hard to tell, man. There's so much stuff going on in a raid like this, but this is a really good looking base and it's gonna be so fun to watch it get three starred. Okay, so we got the invisibility. Invisibility blizzard. Man, I really do wish I had the patience to do this. It is such a fun raid and we did it right when the Super Wiz came out. Or was it right when the invisibility spell came out? Either way, this got really popular for a while and you can see why. I mean, it's very fun. Dragging over the super minions. This is where I always get in trouble. I can never get the super... He froze them just to make sure. Dude, I can never get the super minions out of the base. They're always right smack in the middle of the base. Just trolling you. Just absolutely trolling you. You know what, guys? Hang on. Ellie's so funny. He's like, is that for me? Uh, you sure? You sure I can have this? <laughs> he's, he's so polite. Dude, I love when you see out of the corner of your eye, you see the builders fixing something because it's got, the, it looks like a healer, right? It's the same sort of animation where it's like glowing. This is wild. This is wild. So we've already, I shouldn't say we, Maisie has already taken out the town hall with the sneaky goblins. It's so crazy. So now we're going to go through here, already hit the warden ability. So you know, for a brief period, they're invincible, right? Didn't he just do that? I think so. Hard to tell when it wears off because you got all these spells going as well. Okay, so those balloons are going to go down. It's now basically just up to the dragons. How is this going to be a three star? Man, I'm going to be serious here. I do not see how this is ever going to be a three star. For one simple reason. Uh, what's good? <laughs> There's one single inferno right in the middle of everything there. How you ever? This is really stressful. Wait a minute. Is this not a three star or is it? This is going to be so close. This is going to be so close. So if they had not gone for the inferno there, it would have been a wrap. Oh my God. Look at those dragons. They're almost down. There's one and then one over here and a warden. And that's it, dude. Man, I just want to say thank you to my clan. Thank you to all the enemy clans. I shouldn't say enemy clans, right? The clans that we faced in this league, because I don't ever feel like, like I said, like we can, you know, come over and say what's up anytime, you know? I mean, preferably not during war, because then we're going to think you're just here to steal the bases and... But anyway, guys, that is going to be it for today. Thank you for coming out. We love you guys. If you enjoyed this one, let us know in the comments below. Be sure to leave two for Lulu always, forever. Uh, leave an extra one for Melly as well. Man, we used to watch raids from Joshim all the time. I know that's not how you really say his name. He's Dutch. <laughs> I, I, I just butcher his name all the time. I just call him Joe. And again, I know that's not how you pronounce But if he was American, his name would be Super Joe. He's an honorary American. Because he's my friend. Anyway, yeah, Joe was always killing it. I wish we had more time to watch all of these. But you know what? Let's just go out on this raid, guys. I'm going to hit the... Uh... It's all crazy, dude. Just attacking from opposite sides of the base. I get so confused and lose my lose my train of thought. And just unreal. Anyway, guys, we're going to go out on this one. I'm going to zoom out so we can see everything. But thank you for coming out today. If you enjoyed this one again, let us know in the comments below. Leave three for Melly. He's just too cute today. Look at him, man. Anyway. We will see you guys right here tomorrow on the one and only Beaker's Lab where maybe more, you know, maybe more Town of 14 is going to get three starred. Who knows? <laughs> maybe I'm going to get three starred. I probably am going to get three starred at some point over the next 24 hours. I'm sure. Cool. Anyway, we love you guys. We'll see you right here tomorrow. We'll see you guys then. Peace. Peace.